Hello, and welcome to the build log of my ESP8266 fault detector prototype. This will document how I built my device and also what I will do to improve it in the future. To begin, I acquired the following parts. This is the brain of the device, the ESP8266 ESP12E dev board. It runs the Node MCU OS with Lua. It connects to the Cayenne service via MQTT. This part is the SparkFun 9 DOF stick, which breaks out the LSM 9 DS1 IMU. It can sense angular position, acceleration, and magnetic force. This will sense whenever a person falls. I am also using the Adafruit Micro Poly Charger for charging the lithium ion battery. For power, there is a 1200 mAh lithium ion battery. First, I will begin by laying out all of the components and then assemble them together so I can begin building the enclosure. Next, I will create the bottom half along with two walls. Fast forwarding a bit, you can see now that the device is finished. Inside, everything has been arranged to fit inside of a small footprint. Now, it is time to 3D print. I have laid out each part and will begin to print it. Now that everything is printed, it is time to write some code and get it assembled. I quickly created a simple sketch in the Arduino IDE, which you can find on the project page on hackster.io. Then I assembled and hot glued everything together. So now I have a fully functioning fall detecting prototype. You can either press the button or fall to make it send an alert. If you didn't fall, but the sensor is still tripped, you will have 5 seconds to press the button to avert it from sending a signal. In about a month's time, I hope to create a much smaller and much better looking prototype for about a quarter of the price. Thank you, and I will see you in a month for the follow-up on this project.